returning to Sheffield more than 60 years after the clearance of the slums close to the city centre. Architects and developers have been given the go-ahead to create a new affordable style of back-to-back -back home, which will be eco-friendly and located in areas where the originals once stood. Ian White reports. <laughs> For thousands of people, Victorian back-to-back -back houses were once home for them in Sheffield. But in the 1950s and 60s, they disappeared as part of the government's slum clearance program. A great work, and worthy of its great object. No more slum. We've taken an old idea, which is back-to-back -back housing, and given it a 21st century twist. Now, though, back-to-back -back living is set to return in pretty much the same area it once was. You can't... Think of back-to-back -back houses just in the terms of a Victorian house, which will be cold, dank, basements that were wet and flooded, um, uninsulated, with 20 people living in them. This is a two-bedroom, spacious house. Architects have been working with developers to design affordable new homes that will be eco-friendly and bring back community living to run down parts of Sheffield city centre in Shalesmore, Smithfields and Callum Island. Where we're stood now is inside the inner ring road of Sheffield. This will give convenient lifestyles for people who live in them. You won't need a car, you can walk everywhere, you'll have bars, shops, cafes. And we hope these houses, by putting people in first, will then kickstart lots of other businesses to come around them. The back-to-back -back terraces might be a thing of the past in Sheffield, but in some parts of Leeds, they're still very much part of the landscape, with the people who live in them thinking they're the perfect home. It's fabulous living in it back-to-back. -back. We've lived here over 30 years. Um, and it's a very friendly neighbourhood and we have the benefit of um, three lots of central heating joining us. It's a real friendly environment, um, you know, it's really close-knit community, which I think you, you get with, with uh, the type of houses you've got here. It is a leap of faith considering the connotations of back-to-back -back houses and slums, but using modern technology, there'll be amazing places. So these are not the slums of the future? No, definitely not. <laughs> These are the houses of the future. Ian White, BBC Look North, Sheffield.